All right, let's get into the thick of it with Olivia Plath. She's been the talk of the town, but let's not jump to conclusions. Sure, she's faced her fair share of feuds, but isn't it intriguing that she's always painted as the villain? There's definitely more than meets the eye here. Personally, I think there's a bit of a double standard at play. What's your take? Now, on to the juicy part. Ethan and Olivia's crumbling marriage. This saga's got more twists than a pretzel, folks. Ethan's been spotted with an unknown brunette, scandalous. But let's hold our horses. Could they have been separated already? It's a puzzle wrapped in a mystery. Micah's remarks about Olivia cheating, that's a bold accusation without proof. I'm all for brotherly love, but shouldn't we tread carefully with such claims? It's a classic case of he said, she said. But hey, that's just my opinion. What do you guys think? Is there more to Micah's claims? Or is it just protective instincts kicking in? Mariah and Olivia's friendship hitting the rocks was a shocker. These two were tight, and now it's like watching a friendship apocalypse. It's sad, but hey, sometimes people grow apart. That's life. The Plath family's statement against Olivia? Now that's drama with a capital D. It's almost Shakespearean how they've all turned against her. But isn't it fascinating how everyone quickly sides against one person? I'm not saying Olivia's a saint, but the situation isn't black and white. Kim's evil spirits comment about Olivia. That's harsh, folks. I mean, come on, we're in the 21st century. My two cents? Kim's drama radar is off the charts. What do you guys think? Too much or justified? And Barry, oh Barry. Calling out Olivia's communication style is a bit rich coming from him. Seems like he's had a tough time himself. It's like the pot calling the kettle black, don't you think? Now, Ethan's hesitance about having kids with Olivia, that's a gut punch. It's one thing to have disagreements, but questioning your future together, that's heavy stuff. Personally, I think it speaks volumes about their relationship state. So, my dear viewers, that's the lowdown on Welcome to Plathville Season 5. It's a hot mess, but it's our hot mess. What's your verdict? Team Olivia, Team Ethan, or Team Drama? Let's get a conversation going in the comments. Before you head out, don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring that bell for all the latest updates. Thanks for tuning in. And remember, in the world of TV drama, there's always more than one side to the story. Catch you in the next video, where we'll dive even deeper into the world of celebrity gossip. Stay awesome, and keep questioning everything. Max, signing off. Peace out.